What? That, what, what can I fucking say? I can't. Oh, whatever. What is going on, YouTube? One only extra. I'm here today. Oh, I'm just riding around. I uh, went and saw my family at Only Moto. Said hi. It's been a few months. I've been MIA. I uh, felt good to say hi to these guys. The shop's looking great. It's expanding. They're doing what they can to keep the customers safe. They added some new faces. Yeah, it's just good to be in there. Around all motorcycle lovers and whatnot. Saw, uh, saw a few bikes. They got a few of them that I want coming in. Uh, well, if I get to do a video about what's coming in, I definitely will. Um, but I won't spoil the surprises. Uh. There's definitely some great stuff coming in. And I definitely want to be there for it. Oh boy, but now that we're on motorcycles, you know, people have seen that follow me on Instagram and friends on Facebook have seen that I've offered this up for sale and various people that have asked, you know, what's out there. And I've been asked, are you trying to sell it? Kinda, yeah. Um, while I love this bike, it is a great bike. Ah, uh, it doesn't do much for me. I already have a V4. Yeah, granted, this is a different type of V4, but uh, you know, still provokes the same type of response from it. And or frankly, I was looking for something different. Even when I bought this, I was still looking for something a little bit different. And I ventured into those naked bikes, as I've mentioned before. Um, V4 Ducati makes sense. It's got great reviews. Wouldn't mind it. Don't care enough to have one. Yamaha makes an amazing one, but you know, it's to me, it's soulless, just like the BMWs. You know, they're great bikes. They're solid bikes. It's just not what I'm looking for. Um, which leads me to MV Augusta. Oh man. <laughs> oh god, the worst thing you could ever do in a helmet is sneeze, and there it is. Oh gross, it's all over the side of my face. Oh, so she said, <laughs> um, <laughs> anyways. But the rush and the brutale from Envy Augusta, oh man, are they gorgeous, sexy things. And I can't wait to see the rush in person. I don't know when that'll be, if it'll be anytime soon. But I was told that. I can reserve one. I haven't. Um, however, maybe? I don't know. We'll see. I, I don't know. Like I said, there's, there's a lot of stuff up in the air about what I want to do in the next, for the next bike here. Um, right now, my health is taking priority over everything. I'm trying to get myself right again. And uh, some of you see with my Instagram post, I was in the hospital. Um, I'm doing a lot better. Uh, and I'm doing a lot better without meds. And that, is, that has been uh, kind of my driving force to get myself right, is I don't want to be on medication if I don't have to be. And right now it's proving that, I'm proving myself that I don't necessarily have to be. Uh, because I haven't been diagnosed with anything. You know, all my blood work, all that stuff's been solid. So, um, that's, that's the number one thing for me, is that I'm good in that sense. Oh God, y'all just decided to fucking slow down. So yeah, uh, once that shit's all good and I feel like I'm 100%, we'll be able to stop going to the fucking doctors, except for my yearly stuff, and really focus on the fun things in life. 
but they do have a lot of stuff going on you know school starts back up again in a month which is going to be uh you know another big work club on top of that i got a new got another business venture that i'm starting here and um it's going to be a big one there's a lot of pieces there's a lot of steps and i am in the infancy of it so it's exciting um, because it's going to be the first one of them one of them like what i'm going to do here in tucson so this asshole So I'm excited about that because again, like I said, it's going to be the first here in Tucson uh, of its nature. And uh, you know, there's a lot of planning, there's a lot of, I got to get a lot of licensing, I got to get a lot of permits, but needless to say, it's in the works and I'm excited. So a lot of stuff going on for the X-Ram. I just hope you all are doing well. You know, I've, I don't have a lot of content. I haven't done a lot of content. Um, hoping to change that. I want to do the vet last week I got it clean and then it rained so don't worry there's gonna be a, a Corvette post here in the near future and uh, it's gonna be good hopefully <laughs> I mean is in my content really that terrible no it's not that terrible it's not the most amazing but it's not terrible <laughs> How you doing? Same. It's got heads in, headphones or music in, much like I do. <laughs> I don't get why people just don't stop or they need to fucking stop. Ugh. They don't. It's an interesting couple days here in Arizona because it's been raining. Um, and because, because of that, fucking idiot, um, it's been cooler out. Like, uh, last night, I, yesterday I think it was like 80 maybe. And then, like today I think it's mid 90s. Uh, it's monsoon season as you can see so on top of the heat you know the rain has kind of thwarted some of my writing and video efforts but there you know there's gonna be content coming out to you guys i've been working a lot with uh low light night stuff because it's so hot during the day i like to try to get some light stuff and i've i think i got a good setting on the camera here uh that will play well to where the footage won't be super grainy and it, the other thing is it's the stabilization is kind of terrible in low light unless you have the right settings and that's what i've been trying to uh, mess with so i think i got the right settings now so it's not grainy it's not too jumpy it's uh i got a video that i'm probably going to put up here of a sh very short sunset run and uh yeah it should be good hope y'all are managing everything arizona keeps closing and opening and closing so it is what it is but uh yeah it's, it's some weird fucking times but you know what we'll get through it we'll have some fun in the meantime hopefully y'all are learning something new because um you know you have so much time on your hands maybe i don't know i found that ps4 has been a good escape i've uh i play some Warzone. if any of you guys want to hop on the xbox or ps4 play some Warzone, have some fun i am terrible uh you will kill me repeatedly and laugh the whole time it's all right i'm not that serious about it i usually drink when i play and i mean sip i don't drink drink i don't get drunk it's just not fun anymore um but yeah xram let's look for it you'll see me uh, but with that, I think I'm going to end this video. 
nothing too crazy, too fun. But I just wanted to let you know that I'm still here. I have gained some subscribers. I've crested 900 and I want to thank you all for staying and joining. For those of you that are new, hey, fucking go through all my stuff. I got some cool, got some cool bikes on here. I got some really uh, fun content from the uh, years past. You know, I was talking to e 650 Abe. He's been on, he did his 10 year anniversary and I'm about seven years old myself. So yeah, kind of crazy. Been, uh, been on YouTube for a long time. My numbers may not show that, but hey, like I said, this is a fun thing for me to do. Uh, with that, you all have a good one. I'm gonna get off here, head home, some wild rock, some lunch, swing by my local gun store, say what's up, and uh, yeah, continue on my day. You all have a good one. I'm out. I think. If I can... See a buddy at his gun store. And yes, I switched bikes. I took that turn terribly, but uh, I hit something and slid a little bit. Yeah, we're gonna go see uh, my buddy here at his gun store. Uh, no, I'm not buying anything, not yet. The one that I want is expensive, as you probably would have guessed. It's a damage defense 300 blackout. cool was I was on the Aprilia this morning and this afternoon I'm on the Ducati and it's kind of it's so weird hopping between the two because this is actually a much more comfortable bike got way more leg room it's a little more pressure on the wrist and on the Aprilia but it still feels way different as you get blast in the face of the fucking bug <laughs> But it also just rides totally different, it feels totally different, the clutch is different, the brakes are different. Just everything's different. Not a bad way, in a good way. To, uh, put both these videos together and do a little weird montage. I, can always, I know I can go in there, but I never do. Just never go in there. I think it's just because I like showing off. Oh, pothole. Mm -hmm. <laughs> dirt right here. Let me get this thing fixed. Uh, there we go. There we go. Elite guns.